Live from Jerome Harden Studios. This is the latest of my newscast. I'm willing to tell you about. So as you sit back, relax, chillax, and I'll tell you the latest stuff. What's up, I'm Jay. Are you chilling? All right, let's get started. What we're going to talk about today is how as the world changes. Have you seen major changes around the world lately? I mean, around in this town I live. You know, everybody's having children and stuff. I mean, what's going on with that? Is that a new fashion of getting pregnant or something? I mean, to me, I, I th it, th it seems like it, but uh, why would they get pregnant? I mean, why would everybody get pregnant? Somebody help me answer that question. Oh, yeah, by the way, um, s sometimes, uh, sometimes you want kids, sometimes you don't. I feel like everybody around me has kids. I mean... Can somebody explain to me why they want kids? I mean, uh, as young as uh, 15 to uh, 19 years old. I mean, there are enough teen moms as is. I mean, yeah, <laughs> yeah, it's annoying some people. And they posted ugly shit about teen moms. Talking about uh, their babies are crotch droppings and such, such, that. And uh, they talking shit to the teen moms. And then uh, I put, uh, I wrote the song baby mama drama and it got 215 views but uh i just posted this song back in may and then, uh miraculously it reached to 200 much to my surprise i mean it's not the only video that reached 200 so is my other videos such as the parkway one and the well that's about it the others are doing okay but um yeah that's what i'm here to talk about but yeah Something else too. Um, you see how all these, all these talk shows are coming about. Like uh, the test, it's a talk show that is copying off of Maury Povich. I mean, why would they make more talk shows if we already, if the other talk shows are doing the good? We have more talk shows than anywhere. Like uh, Trisha Goddard, Maury, the Steve Wilco Show, Jerry Springer. Um, Jeremy Kyle show, Wendy Williams only a celebrity talk show. They don't invite, uh, Wendy Williams don't invite guests over. Yeah, all these talk shows and all these fake shows. I mean, do you remember what TV was like back then? So, Soon and So Quiet brings back memories. Or, you remember as a child, you used to have a good time playing in your backyard all the time, playing with bugs, playing with... Little insect playing with your pets. You know, it's a great time and you don't have to worry about anything. Now, it's 2013. And those of you that lived in the childhood back in the 90s through 2001, right before the Twin Towers came down, just like a soothing, quiet, peaceful day. I mean, no hot temperatures. I mean, mostly shades. I mean, cooler temperatures. And you just get to sit in your bed, just go to sleep all day if you want. Or... But still, you had to go to school and do the little baby stuff, easy stuff. And don't forget this. I just browsed some of the Jerry Springer theme songs. And some of you told me that Jerry Springer wasn't real. Oh, I don't believe that. Well, um, what I can tell you is... I can tell that uh, some of the shows are fake because of their crimes and stuff. Normally, when you cry, you see tears coming out of your eyes. But, uh... When they crying, I don't see no tears coming out of their eyes whatsoever. But sometimes I do. But it's impossible sometimes to make yourself cry. It's sometimes it make it possible to make yourself cry that it's all so fake. And most millions of people say uh, that was uh, fake. But I don't believe that junk. Um, yeah, so some of you can say it's fake all you want. And, I, you know, I just still watch it. Just still watch it for entertainment. I mean, just seeing people crying makes me so happy. I mean, I just like to see... I just enjoy people's misery, that's all. I mean, <laughs> please, you shit ass. I'm not talking about my friends or stuff. I mean, if you're miserable and stuff, I'll try to cheer you up. But uh, on TV, as such and such, if I see their boyfriends leaving the girl or they dumping them or... Something bad happened to the girl, like they're going to jail and stuff. You know, I just enjoy people's misery, and they started crying. And you know, I don't feel bad for them. Just sit there and just enjoy the, enjoy the drama.
You know, that's how life is. I mean, I just posted it as one of the theme songs as my favorite last night on Facebook. And, um, I just want you to hear it. And, you know, I'm just going to speak through it and see how you like it. I mean, some of it, um, it's okay, but, uh, Today, um, music we had, it was just, like, uh, similar to the 2002 to 2005 one. But still, the, the still, it's a classic. Nothing today is a classic. You see, um, Disney Channel's going bad, Nickelodeon sucks, Cartoon Network's having trouble. I mean, what else is next? I mean, is all the cartoons gonna become human sitcoms now? Because, uh... And flash drawings and stuff, cause uh, our society is too lazy to make cartoons from scratch. And oh yeah, my website is going to be having updates real real soon, as of today. I mean, more music is going to be added, and the lyrics to my baby mama drama song is going to be on there as of today. So keep looking for it, and just be just be on your toes for it, cause you know it's going to be a very exciting fall for you. So, just like the fall season's coming up, I just want to give you something extra special to start your football season off real well. And of course, sometimes I watch football too. Just not a whole lot. Because, uh, foot, you know what I'm going for. I mean, I'm going for Alabama, but uh, I don't go to that college. You know, I go to some other college, like a two year college, but I'm not going to tell you my location. You know, my life is none of your business. What, but what I can tell you is, um, changes around the world and stuff still, um, there's lots of fights going on, there's, uh, lots of child molestations going on, lots of accidents on the roads, and people destroying beautiful stuff, well, it's a bunch of bullshit right there, and more, a lot of older people Find a little, little 27 an hour, 27, 25 an hour jobs. Yeah, that sucks too. And people losing their houses, their jobs, or their, um, their children. And because, uh, they couldn't, uh, afford to feed them. Or they're doing something bad to the children. Who knows? Yeah. Uh, I just made a little, uh, slideshow. And I'm gonna guide you through it, see what you're to bring you back your childhood memory. You know I'm getting tired. You know you you know uh, I had talked about this in the past, right? But I had I talked a little bit about it. But I'm going to detail you on uh, what your childhood was like. But I wrote a story about it on my website too. Um, I'm just that type of guy that likes older classic stuff. I mean, I don't like the new stuff on TV except Blizzard Lick Toyin and Operation Repo, True TV stuff, or Tosh.0, or the new movies that are coming out, or the new South Park. Um, I don't, I don't, I, 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 I don't watch South Park anymore, but I'll look into that sometime. The South Park is used to be my favorite show. Well, yeah. And Steve Wilkos, he kicks ass, you know. He was in the military. He was, like, uh, getting on people's cases about child molestation and stuff. He likes saving people's lives before they get ruined forever. Like, say this woman lying on this man about molestation, and this man is getting accused in jail for it, and he, and he passes his case. He's, uh, he's proved to not be uh, molesting his children, and the woman is lying all along. I mean, that stuff can ruin your life right there if you are a man. Or a lot of such, such and such and such like that. So, um, just getting, look into that. I mean, you know, never know what's going to happen in life. I mean, look, just like you look for job opportunities, and they say they're going to hire you and stuff, but something comes up, and then they say they're not hiring you. I mean, uh, you have to look into that stuff. <coughs> well, you have to keep your Facebook page clean in order to, uh, Get a job. I mean, of course, they haven't looked into my Facebook page yet. I don't know why. But, um, they can make up excuses why they're not hiring you, which is a bunch of bullshit.
you know. Yeah, I mean, life is bullshit. Um, yeah, but only thing you can hope for is um a miracle that could happen. So, uh, yeah, just look into that. But enough talk. I just want to take you on the memories we had back. And hopefully that can uh, refresh your memory of what it's like. And not Glostia. I mean, I can't say that word right. But whatever. Yeah, just like, um, hope it's a, t I think it's a 10 minute video. So, uh, cause uh, I don't do much newscast anymore. So, um, yeah. That's what, uh, what it's all about. You know, I plan to be working and go to school at the same time to keep myself occupied. I mean, you know. So, yeah. Just take you to that clip, and then after you get done, you come back see me. I'll end this newscast from there. All right, let's go, and I'll walk you through it. So, you know what I'm talking about. Holy shit, I'm remembering this one. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Yeah, I bar barely remember that one. Yeah. But still, it's pretty cool. Holy shit, I remember this one. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Man, I gotta, I gotta see this. Because this used to be the shit right there. All these shows right there. Ooh, yeah. I like that. Ridiculous. We're simply remodeling our house, and this is the all-time favorite. Short notice. Frankly, I appreciate it if you kept it under wraps. If people knew I was living here, well, they might get the wrong idea. I mean, it is a dump. Rhonda, I live here. Yes. Well, oh, this is I'm fine dirty. <laughs> What's wrong with I'm dirty? The woman has a full-grown mustache. Kenan. <laughs> I supposed to eat my Thanksgiving turkey when I'm staring at a woman who looks like she got a big old hairy caterpillar crawling all on her nose. <laughs> hey, hey, Keenan, when she comes, let's shave her. You know what I'm saying? Hey, my boy. No, no, no. Neither of you will shave Aunt Gertie. <laughs> and listen, no comments about her mustache. From the look of it, I'd say a lot of parents are gone. What? Did, I, did they all go to Florida? Maybe they went to get juice or something. I don't digest pulp well. It makes me bloaty. Got her. Scan for adult life forms. Hey, what are they all looking at? I don't know, but it's in a classroom. It can't be that exciting. Hey, y'all, come here. It's the Hollywood film crew in there. <gasps> Why would they start going to our school? Oh, they're scouting locations for the new movie. I don't know, zombies. Wait a second, they're shooting a movie in our school? Yeah. Oh, excuse me, excuse me. Oh, that's Toshi Nakamura, the hottest director in Hollywood. That's the hottest director in Hollywood, I see. Helen did not promote me. She's getting laser eye surgery today. Laser eye surgery? <laughs> All right, people. Yeah. Did you enjoy it? Okay, I'm glad you did. But now I gotta end this newscast, and it's possibly it is gonna be a long time for you to see me again, as long as fake Thanksgiving arrives. So until then, I'll see you next time. But until next time, I Jedi got out peace. See you till Thanksgiving. Okay, bye.